What's up YouTube? Welcome to my channel. Today we're here at Cow Ranch Park. If you're unsure what the story behind this park is, two brothers that were murdered, which remains unsolved. Okay. So on to the story. The story started in the 1900s. The neighbor wanted tobacco, decided to go to the Kyle residence to buy tobacco. No answer at the door, he looks into the door and finds Edwin Kyle lying dead on the floor with a handgun next to him. Not too far away, they find William Kyle in a ditch, partially underwater. At this point, when they look into it, they, com they considered it as a murder-suicide. In 1975, they resumed the bodies to do more research. This is when they find out that both of them were murdered and remains unsolved. Okay, so I want to add in here. If you happen to see anything, please timestamp it in the comments below. Anything that I might have missed, misheard, period. Just let me know in the comments below. It's very greatly appreciated. Now what I wonder is, if you see this ditch here, follows down all the way down there to the dollhouse. And farther west. Is this the ditch that Edwin was found in? Edwin, this is your chance to speak. The microphone I have on this could pick up whatever you're saying very well. So please, get up as close as you can. Speak into the mic. Let the people of today know what happened to you. We're all curious here. Okay, folks, when I'm doing my editing later on, I will be listening very closely to see if I have any response from Edwin. If so, I would notate it in the video. Okay, so we stand in front of what they call the dollhouse. This small cottage known as the dollhouse was not on the property during the time of the Keel family era. The dollhouse is only 
Sorry, I apologize. The dollhouse is the only remaining cottage construction by Edwin during the glamour era. From research, this house actually has nothing to do with the Kyle brother murders. As you see in the photos here, this is what it looked like inside that house. Another photos from the past. This is dating from all the way from 1911. More photos from the past. Of course, the bottom photo is what they were back then was the White House. Not the White House that we know today. This house is not on the property, nor even around anymore. So this dates right here, that Kyle Ranch was purchased in 1901 by Utah, Nevada, and California Railroad, owned by the U.S. Senator and mining William Clark. More photos. I'm going to try my best to get this to show you the burial plot. This is very tricky with these bars here. If you look right there, that is where Edwin, William, and Conrad, Kyle, are buried. Laid the rest. May you rest in peace. I'm going to walk around here and try to get a little bit closer to the burial. 
my microphone on my pod here actually picks up very well. Okay, any of the Kyle can any of the Kyle family want to speak. This is your chance. I'm right here. Literally right next to your your gravesite. Do whatever it takes. This is your chance to speak up. Let the world of today know what happened to you. Now, I've already asked if Edwin could speak over by so-called ditch. Well, this is a chance for William to speak. As we know, William was found in the house dead with a handgun next to him, which caused a whole spiel thinking it was a murder-suicide, and it wasn't. So this goes out to William and Edwin. This is your chance. Speak. I want to apologize for the background noise. Unfortunately, this park is surrounded by industrial, so we will have noises in the background, but I will be listening very carefully during the editing of this, and I will notate it in the final view if I heard anything or not. Now I'm going to walk back over here because I strongly believe that the ditch that William was found in is back here. This is a very tranquil, beautiful thing back here. I'll tell you right now, in the beginning of the video, you will see this lovely little river right here and our little friend. Sounds like he wants to say something. Of course. I'm sitting there fooling around with the duck over here. Where I'm pointing at, first I heard something smack. I don't see anything back there. No, it's not, not her or him. Then just minutes later, I heard, and you know what? I just saw something flew right in front of the camera and there's not much of an insect issue right now. Who knows? I'll look further into that and document it. I heard something over here. Now I'm going to go ahead and try to figure it out. Maybe one of Ducky's little friends are back here. But the whole time we've been here, I don't see. I haven't seen another one. I mean, I could leave it to being just another smaller animal, but being it's, it's somewhat cold outside, I mean, anything's going to be underground trying to keep warm. But it is a lot of brush over here. And as usual, when you stop recording, something happens, right? It never fails. I'm going to repeat myself actually. If you see anything that I missed, point it out, timestamp it immediately. Please do so. Very greatly appreciate it. Last but not least, I want to at least say I wouldn't be doing this if it wasn't for Black Collar Project. As I did in the last video, I will put his link to his YouTube channel below so you can check it out as well.
And don't forget, I will have new content. Basically, I'm trying to do it every, trying to get an upload either Thursday or Friday every week. Something new. So please subscribe to my channel. It would it would be so grateful. I'd, I'd be grateful for you doing so. And make sure to select the option to have your notifications on because you will be notified immediately the minute I upload next the next video. And I'm telling you just how I said it before. It's just going to get more interesting from here on out. Alrighty then. Good night, YouTube. This is going to end this session. Just remember subscribe, hit that like button. Make sure your notifications are on because when the next video drops, you will be notified immediately. And another thing, I wanted to say thanks to Black Collar Project. If it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be doing this. So his link to his channel is down below. Check it out, subscribe to his channel. You know the rest. Bye-bye.